That's okay. Malinark. <clears throat> Steam vents. Please don't be just Kai Control. You're okay. Actually, your comment made perfect sense. I just didn't register it all the way. I don't think it was you. <coughs> um, excuse me. You think it's Storm? Just because I played Serum Visions? Or because you know Malinark? I've been seeing a lot of Jeskai Control and like Jeskai Geist decks running around, so that's why I jumped to that's what it was, or I thought it was. Because they fetched for an untapped vent for Serum Visions. Yeah. I don't know, we'll find out soon enough. Uh, no past turns. So we're holding up Spill Pierce, and on instep, we will violin Carry Sketcher. Yeah, I know. I don't really like the Jeskai control deck. It's very frustrating to play against. Instep. Last night, I had explained to somebody that they couldn't counter the creature that I brought in off of Aether Vial. That was interesting, because normally people know that interaction. Because they've seen Aether Vial enough, but I guess they hadn't played against Merfolk very much or something, so they didn't they didn't know how Aether Vial worked. So I think it was really frustrating, and they tried to counter it multiple times. So like I, they kept showing me the cards in their hand, which must be incredibly frustrating. Yes, please. Oof, another Regery. Interesting. Well, I mean, Flooded Strand is what they started with. That's why I jumped to Jeskai. Not just the Steam Vents. Correct, and that's all we've seen is Flooded Strand, Steam Vents, and Serum Visions. So, not too helpful yet. And I'll turn into a board wipe because they'd take care, they'd do that. I wish I had a lord I could bring in here. Yeah, Bolt makes me think it's not Storm. Yeah. And Colonnade, that means we're in Jeskai. I am like 95% sure we're playing against Jeskai control right now. We roll it up so we can play Regery and then drop Master Waves. Ooh. <laughs> I miss all kinds of little triggers like that. It's it's frustrating. 
Like, although the people who are watching say that the um, not being allowed to sideboard was a bug, not that I clicked through it. So I'll have to like go watch it, make sure I didn't accidentally click through it. Alex Wax, thank you for following. Yes, I think we're definitely playing against Jeskai Twin. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense to me. <laughs> True. Okay, yesterday I played... Um, th oh, there's a whole bunch of guys there who are playing um, Eldrazi Tron. <clears throat> Excuse me. And... Are they going to Lightning Helix? Uh, so this guy's opening hand, Farzetti, thank you for following. Uh, so, no, his opening hand was, um, I mimic, um, endless one, endless one. I'd rather have my Reedry than my Curse Catcher in the same devotion, so we'll do that. No, I think he knew that on his hello. Um, yeah, perhaps six stuff. Eldrazi is normally relatively straightforward for the Merfolk matchup. Um, it's a pretty good it's a pretty good matchup for us. They can pay for it, but it takes up their whole turn. Hmm, it's worth it to you. All right. Colonnade does a lot of work. It's a very good card. This was pure colorless Eldrazi. They were not running any colored spells. It was Eldrazi Tron. It was really interesting. Snap Path. Yeah. Okay. Keep us from drawing lands, hopefully thin out our deck a little bit. <coughs> true, Dr. Demento. That is true. Oh, not what we wanted. Colony costs four or five to activate, though. I always think it's four, but it's five every time. <laughs> every time I look at it. Um. Generally, no, Speaker Ender. Uh, it is a downside that is part of Path to Exile. Adam the Greek, thank you for following. Yeah, um, the guy that was streaming last night with that list is part of the team that was the same group that was playing that night. They were telling me that he was, instead of coming out, he was streaming it last night instead. 
So it's the exact same guy, exact same list. Same list I played. Which is kind of cool, actually. They have an island, so it doesn't really matter, but what else am I going to untap or tap? I guess I could tap their colonnade or something, or tap their steam vents to cut them off red. That might have been better. Um... Drayahawk3289. Thank you for following. Hi there, Hindcatcher. Oh, yeah, if you don't shuffle deck your deck, I guess you wouldn't search. Oh my goodness, please let me play. Okay. Hindcatcher, thank you for following. Oh, it froze again. Thank you for following, Hindcatcher. <laughs> we, um, I think we are too short, but I, this is the, um, thing in the corner, wherever, over there. Um, oh, bummer. It does not always update right away. Yep, cello stream. <laughs> Ah, uh, yeah, true, Dr. Demento. Nope. This one. I'm pretty sure it's going to be not this coming weekend, but the one after it, since the Pro Tour and all that kind of stuff. Oh, really? Uh, that really sucks. I'm not going to trade my Mutavolt for the Snapcaster if I can help it. Nope, not dual queuing. Not going to happen. <laughs> <coughs> that in the wrong order oh sorry I think I like men welcome back another remand this is very frustrating this is still, no, this is game, what game is this? This is game one, I think. Try number three. 
so grindy. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> Pass the turn! <laughs> and all they're doing is passing the turn, too. They can't a animate Celestial Colony until they hit one more land drop. Come on, deck. This time it can't be remanded. Thank you. This is extremely miserable, Quinlow. But next turn, I can Vapor Snag their Snapcaster and get in for lethal. Three remands in a row hit the same silver gill that I cast for five three times in a row. Oh my goodness. <sighs> Alright, they did not have their ne next land drop, so Colonnade's not going to hit me this time. But it will next. Alright, we need a Lord. And then we can attack for lethal. At least we can kill a colonnade. That's not bad, actually. <coughs> um, not at this point. <laughs> they would just snap electrolyze if I... Or no, yeah, they would just snap electrolyze if I bounce their snapcaster. So there's no point in doing that without it being lethal. Resto Angel. So there begin combat. That was really dumb. I should have just taken the three. I could take the three. Now they're going to flash it in a block of Mutavault. That was really, really bad. I should not have done that. Restoration Angel needs double white, but we got that, so...
Draw something playable, please. <sighs> kind of. I mean, we're working towards it. Spell Pierce won't help us either, deck. It's three into white. Thank you, Morphetire. So I don't want to attack with my Muta Vault right now. Ajeho HS. Thank you for following. They're going to flash her in this time. Yeah, but I'm w I can work on both. <laughs> By hitting the Sacred Foundry. Snap into what? Electrolyze. Alright, so he's got Electrolyze in his hand. <coughs> To hit me for two. Okay. Should have left that Restoration Angel tapped. Is this still game one, for real? Oh, I'm not sick anymore, Silent Arbor. I have a little bit of a lingering cough, but that's all it is. I am not sick at all, and it's fantastic. Okay. It's not like I'm hurting for mana. Wizards is always selling ticks. <laughs> they haven't replayed their resto. I wonder if they are listening. Hey, look, there's Master Waves. That makes these guys both three threes. Yeah. They've managed to refill their hand. <coughs> Blasterder man, thank you for following. Yep. Oh, oh crap. Forgot about that part of Restoration Angel. Do I even have any more? I mean, yeah, I've, I definitely do. Kempsk, thank you for following. An alternate win, thank you, or alternate win, I guess, probably. Thank you for following. <coughs> I 
Hi there, call me. <laughs> Perhaps MTG notices. Lefarious, thank you for following. Um, so they still would have been able to path it, so it wouldn't have mattered really. Why did I put one on the left and one on the right? That's strange. Rimks! Thanks for following. That was the dumbest. That was game one. Alright, so Chalice can hit some of their stuff, but probably not enough. We want Dismember in here. We want Kira. Um, we probably want Negate. Rage Race, less helpful. Curse Catcher. Well, no, we're going to be on the play. G Power 1, thank you for following. So we've totally made 2000 now, guys. Ah! So one week from now, well, probably one week from this weekend, but we'll have my celebration stream and I'll play cello. Yeah. Oh, yep. Snag is definitely not nearly what we're looking for. And Tidebinder is not very helpful. We'd rather have Regery in. Same with Harbinger. We'd rather have our reed trees. Yep, cello stream! <laughs> yeah, we'll go first. We don't have double blue. But I guess we'll keep this. Um, yeah, we probably could have brought in three tech edges and taken out some, um, files since it's a grindy matchup. Oh, what? I thought I was hitting okay to my key in my hand or something. I don't know what I did, but at least we got it. Yep, um, I, that's what I went to school for. I am a professional cellist. <laughs> Yeah, Vile is good. I I don't know. There's blue. Thank you, D-Slap. <laughs> Sometimes, most of the times though, but rarely do you play both. Bolt? <sighs> Hi there, Mr. Thaddeus. They'll just pay for it, so yeah, I guess that happens. Alright, well, Kira gets to hit the field this time. Oh, that makes sense, D-Slap. Alright. Next time we can play Master and Attack with Mutavault, probably. We'll see what happens. Yes, I think we will... I, I mean, we're going to see everything at the Pro Tour. There's going to be Hey Bears, there's going to be Just Kite Control. There's going to be... Because I've seen a lot of those. There's going to be the Eldrazi decks. A whole bunch of different versions. There's going to be Merfolk. There's going to be all your normal ones. Burn, Infect, all of that. Uh, there's going to be old school Tron. I mean, everything is going to be at the Pro Tour. Everything. But yeah, I think there's going to be lots of Eldrazi. Which means playing fish is a good idea. Spreading seas. We can cut them off red. Or we could kill a colonnade. Probably better. Um, I like our first our attack plan though. Mm. 
New one, mana, old one, creature. Bam. Deck in for seven. Oh yeah, affinity. Green, black, X, so Jun and Abzan. Delver will be there. Oh yeah, Seahunts is gonna be there. Oh man. That's so silly. Okay. Ugh. And it's gonna work, because I can curse catch it, but they'll pay. Oh, well, it, it took them two cards. <coughs> no, Speaker Ender. I should definitely not do that. <laughs> I don't know why they, they um, conceded at that point. Oh, no! Ah, oh, too late. Crap. I was going to switch out... Tech Edge and um, Spreading Seas. Dang. Oh yeah, I had two Muta Vaults. Never mind. I forgot that I had two of them. I thought I only had one. That will not work. They also mulliganed. That will not work either. That's better. Hi there, Killer Bonds. Hi there, Ewok Slaughter. Um, we need more gas. So I actually need to put this on the bottom. Ooh. Oh, okay. Um, I've played a bunch of different Eldrazi decks, and it is a relatively easy matchup. I would say it's 70%, almost 70% our favor, maybe 65. It's, it's good. It's pretty good for us. Yeah, absolutely, Dr. Mento. Stony Silence. Interesting. They brought Stony Silence in for Aether Vial. Alright, so we have a couple options. We could Spreading Seas cut them off red. We could Spreading Seas cut them off white. We could, which is probably better. No, that's a fountain, not a colonnade. Alright, so probably red. Um... We could cast Silvergill now. Silvergill's probably better. Once they play another land, we'll have a better idea of what we can cut them off of. And once we cast Curse Catcher, we won't be able to cast Silvergill, so. Oof, another Spreading Seas. We are not drawing very well. Uh, yeah, Kiki Court will be there too. Okay. Ooh, they missed a land drop. I went ahead and played the Muta Vault first because otherwise I wouldn't have the blue to play Curse Catcher. <coughs> yep. Path is better for us than Bolt is because at least off of Path we get a land. Ooh. 
Would you really, Mr. Thaddeus? That's better than spreading seas. Sorry, um, I think Hero is better than Spreading Seas this time. But we'll do Spreading Seas next time. Oh my goodness! Lord, 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 yay! Thank you, Deck. We only have two cavern, but yes, I understand what you mean, over voltage. Celestial colonnade, guess what gets to be spreading seized? <sighs> hmm. Or is that better? That's probably better than hitting the colonnade this turn. Because one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. <gasps> Yeah. Sorry, Carrick. Yeah, I mean, if we were telling you, I guess. Would the clock have been the same? Yeah, the clock would have been the same. I mean, he can't even kill me with one path. But a second white source, then he could pass path. Yay, everyone! Goody, goody! <laughs> It just feels so good having eight tokens hit the battlefield. 